Welcome to Petty and Particular, K. Stephan Presents and Rambling K. We are everybody tonight. Every woman, it's all in us. Nobody told me, but praise God. Yeah, I started off on the wrong one. It's good. <laughs> Work it out, sis. You got there. That's all that matters. We are here. So what we're doing tonight, though, is Rambling K. Production. Please. I am Valerie Danzi of K Stephan Presents. And this is a product launch. We're doing something a little different. Rambling K has done some other things in the past, but we've never done a product launch. So here we are. She and I, me and her, us is doing a product launch. So the product that we're talking about tonight is called Lavender Rose Oil. And it is a product that she's going to tell us uh, uh, how to use, what it's all about. Let me see. I got a little. Here, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are the ingredients on the side. Uh, the lavender rose. See that? There we go. Lavender rose oil. Uh-uh. I'm crooked. I'm crooked. I'm crooked. That's all right. We, we see it. Thank you. There it is. I'm going to make sure people can read it. Yeah, so we that's what we got going tonight. It is a personal beauty product. And as a, a, a personal beauty product person, I love stuff because she's my daughter. She knows how many little bottles I have all around the house. And subsequently, she has quite a few herself. Now she's making more little bottles to put up. All right. Our person today is Kayla. She is Rambling Kay. And tell us, a little bit about your product and what you do. Uh, first of all, tell us I, what about you first. Okay, hey, first of all, um, my name is now September. That's what we're doing. Uh, you can still call me K because it's September K, but it's September now. My mama's not going to remember that, but for those of you out there, uh, we are going by September. Thanks so much. Um, I am um, what I'm supposed to say. I'm, so I'm tell me, me, tell me, how did you get into uh, making products? I don't know. What I just it about. I know a few uh, years ago you just kind of started like, hmm, what about this? But you've always researched things. What what made you? Well, let's start with this product in particular, lavender rose oil and um, the cinnamon oil, which is another product that's a part of the same uh, line that we're doing today. Tell us, um, tell us, how did this come about? What what made you do the oil? Dandruff. Dandruff. So this is a product that we can use in our hair. Yes. Um, I currently live with someone who has dandruff. Okay. I have a mild little case of it. If I don't wash my hair at least once a week, you know, we get, we get flaky in the head. Mm -hmm. um, but the person that I made this for actually mm -hmm. has a little bit worse case than I do. Um, yes. And so I was just like, child we out here trying to figure out what to do i know what to do we gonna grease that scalp see but it's not it's not something you can put on the back of your hand like you know used to put it on the back end. no no it's a, it's an oil um the oils come with as my mom showed um the bottle she showed have a dropper mm -hmm. uh the one i have currently has oop, i didn't hit the mic has a spray top um right. you can use it either way okay. um just you know right right on the head you know some people find using a dropper to get to the scalp a little you know is a little easier I personally have hair um thank god that is <laughs> transitioning towards the locks so I can get to my scalp way easier than I could just a few months ago and it was impossible to get to the, <laughs> the roots of my head you have very thick hair right and I we know, know folks sure. <laughs> and we know people who have way thicker hair than mine um so we know thickness can be an issue so we've got you uh, a dropper bottle and a spray bottle both come with the product um right. so you can decide how you want to how you want to apply it to your life uh sure, sure. We mentioned it's good for hair. It's also good for skin. I've got some on my face. I just hopped out the shower and put just, you know, I did one squirt out the bottle, just right in the hand, rubbed it together, rubbed it on my face. Um, what does it do when you're on your face? 
Well, Is number one, glow or, or child. I don't know. Am I glowing? You you glowing, but you know. You don't okay, greasy, well, though, because there's greasy and then there's glowing. <laughs> you know, I do both looks. I don't mind looking greasy. I went to work one day and my HR manager was like, pu- pulled me to the side and was like, now I know sometimes I'd be greasy and shining, but your forehead is just out of control. And I was like, well, let me get a little napkin. I don't want to make you uncomfortable, but I don't want to have dry skin either. <laughs> I'd, I would rather walk around glistening than have dry skin. Um, But yeah, it, it helps with dry skin um what i really like is that the majority of the oil in this product is grapeseed oil Mm -hmm. which does not stain so if you get it on your clothes your sheets your head rag whatever it's not gonna stain it you just wash it it's good um as far as the ingredients in it lavender and rose are um actually lavender rose and cinnamon so all the all the product we have is good for calming irritation antifungal all of that kind of thing because what people some people don't know is that dandruff can be a fungal infection definitely um as my mother and i know because we've gone to school the beauty school the the hair head and hair school Mm -hmm. um yeah, d- dandruff can be a fungal infection or it can be dry skin. So mm-hmm. I'm trying to make a little product that can tackle both issues. Grapeseed exactly. oil and almond oil are the oils that are in the, the product. Um, and both of those have really great penetrating properties for skin um, and scalp is skin. Um, and very if you have... So. I think people don't really think about it in that way, but it very much is. Yeah, it's just skin. It's skin at the top of your head, child. Covered with hair. It's the same skin as your forehead. It just got more, you know, follicles. Mm-hmm. Um, bigger yeah. follicles too. <laughs> yeah, bigger and more. Um, but honestly, your skin and your scalp are just the same girl. So mm-hmm. you want to keep it moisturized. You want to keep it clean, and you want to keep the fungus off of it. No which means you don't want to keep it too moist because fungus li- fungus likes moisture as well. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Um, but we 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 don't have all day to talk about fungus, honey. No, can, no, no, no. This is not <laughs> the fungal fungal show. <laughs> but um, the products that I'm using have antifungal properties. So if you're dealing with the dry scalp, you've got your oil. If you're dealing with the fungus, you've got your uh, your lavender, your rose, or your cinnamon, depending on which one you choose to buy exactly okay that's that sounds like a something we could we could deal with Mm -hmm. with so um how how do you get this product right now you go to my mama and say hey girl how's it going i'm your Uh, mama yeah, that's my mom right there. You book you a point an appointment down to the Ansel Salon if you're uh-huh, in town, uh-huh. and you get you you get you a little hairstyling, and say, "Hey, girl, can you uh, sample some of that that earl on my head?" And my mom will probably say, "Yeah, she nice." Yeah, and you can and, message um, me through um, through the website, um, kseffin dot com. Message me you want the product, and and then I'll get back with you. And we'll we'll get it to you. Yeah, and we're going we gonna to work on shipping. We, we're, fi- we're figuring out shipping now. So if you're not in the area, um, we're going to figure that out too. Yeah, yeah. so there's, it's going to be $12 a bottle plus shipping. So that's what it'll be. I, my kid, she talks slower for me. I got to make sure. <laughs> my mama just made an executive decision right here on this camera before your very eyes. Without discussing with me. My name is Mama. <laughs> it's like, okay, ma'am, you, you make your decision, child. <laughs> but that's what it is. It is what it is. So, yeah, I think I've, I've enjoyed it. You know, I've um, shared it with a couple of people that um, have come through because I wanted to do this first and, and get back into the salon and, and, and uh, you know, start to share with my clients. And that's, that's really what I'm doing. And um, people have been kind of like, hmm, impressed with it. And of course, um, uh, Kay Stephan uh, and Rambling Kay have the little cheering section. And we appreciate the cheering section who's not trying to see what, what in the world is going on 
with uh, K. I, I don't think they're really interested in me. It's the kid. They they like the kid. They like. Well, me. the thing about it is just I'm just I do more. I'm far more interesting. And there's you know <laughs> it just is what it is when you're legendary like myself. <laughs> <laughs> the girls just want to know what's going on. <laughs> Thought I was the legendary one. Okay. I brought the legend. How's that? <laughs> sure. It's been an honor and a privilege to talk to my own, my very own child for my first uh, showcase of K Stephen Presents. We are trying to partner with small businesses, businesses like us, and just talk about what we do. And if you have something that you think um, will fit in our, our presentations, just contact um, ksteffendiversity.com, message me, and we will look at doing this very same thing with you. Thank you, Rambling K. Thank you so much for having me, Mom. <laughs> it's been wonderful. It's been wonderful. You bullied me into this. I want, before we go, I want everybody to know she did not give me the option. She did not say, would you like to come on the show? Was that uh, supposed to? Yeah. That's, it's how you treat your guests. You say, hi. But you, you're my how guest you? child. You say, hi, how are oh you? God. I have a show that I'd like you to come and be a part of. That's just how it works in the biz. You were so unprofessional towards me not towards anybody else y'all if y'all want to book <laughs> if y'all want to book to be on the show come on she she not gonna be like that with y'all but towards myself it was just completely un unprofessional unprofessional I'm gonna pray for you you know what thank you I need prayers I'm not even Catholic not you know I just you know hallelujah praise God Ebo Sha. Mm -hmm. see they don't Ebo shy. I don't think well, that's all right. I do. I do too. <laughs> but yes, it's been fun. So we got we we do some other stuff that uh we we're gonna try to pick up in the in the coming weeks, and hopefully you guys can watch us do that as well. Thanks for watching.